that is what happened at the shop. Okay, finally a day to work on my car. Well, I'm actually bringing it to a shop. I need to get some tires swapped around. I wanna go on all stocks. So I don't really have to worry day to day when I drive this car. You guys saw the wheels. I like those stock wheels compared to my other ones. Can't wait till they're on, but we have to go to the shop now. And I'll give you guys a quick look. I have these stock wheels on right now and the RPF ones, but I'm having like a good amount of issues when I drive. I I kind of don't want to deal with it. Yeah, I'm gonna keep these as spares for eventually when I have money to spend on tires and all that. Probably gonna go with a set. Pretty hot day today. I got everything in here, so I'll see you guys at the shop. Should be quick. I was just gonna have them do the tires, but since I'm there, I'll have them put it on too. Minor, a little dent happened, but it's okay. I'm gonna get a guy to fix it. And the tires are on. Look good. Here's the RPF one. Yo guys, Tyler here, and I'm back with another video. I know I didn't get much in the beginning, but that's because I was having a pretty stressful day. I don't know, this whole day with my car has been horrible. It's like the only car, the only day out of the week where I get to spend time with my car, it goes terrible. From the start, actually, I'll show you guys the aftermath, I guess I would, I'd say. I'll go home and tell you guys the story. All right, here she is. Looks pretty good. I love the look of these wheels. Might go lower, still I won't be fender to lip, which sucks. You can really tell the camera now up front. Okay, here's the horrible part. That is what happened at the shop. I don't know, I really don't like bringing my car to a shop, but sometimes you have to, you know, and every time it does happen, something has to go wrong. I'll give you guys a better look. It looks pretty good. Right there, that's the shot. Ooh. Yeah, I'll catch you guys at my house. That's mostly all how she looks. I love it. Oh man, this was a long ass day. It's 4.20. It's also 11 p.m. I usually sleep around 9.30 because I wake up pretty early. But stuff happened today. Let's see. Um, I started the video. I got my car and tried to get the tire swapped around so I could run all stocks. The whole purpose for that was to drive and not have any worries except for being low so you just like swear potholes and all that what happened when i got there i got there i had to wait for quite a long time to even get my car started on they finally got my car kind of up the driveway which was rough also because my fitment i know my car the best i i knew i should have drove it up i guess it's a mobile dyno um, was in the shop where the door is. They ended up going over like the cables and box. I'm not sure what exactly the box is, but my car brung the cables with it. The two parts of the dyno that attached your car went together. One didn't hit it, the other hit my car. I realized that after the fact it happened. I thought of it as there's a problem, I need a solution. So I called a mobile dent removal guy and he seems pretty nice. I will make a video. Yeah, this makes content for you guys. Trying to find the good out of the situation. I have touch-up paint too. I, the only thing I want is that dent removed. 
I was talking to a subscriber today over DMs and we were talking about how like our car is us. Kind of like our baby. It goes through similar things that we do. When you try to make things better for your car or something, stuff doesn't always go as planned. And things may happen, make it worse. It's, that's like exactly how life is sometimes. That's something to know. Think about your car and your situation, if it relates or if not, I don't know. Ah, oh, it sucks. But sometimes, oh, I learned this today too. Sorry if this is a rant and you guys don't want to listen to it, but I learned a lot today. Time is finite and you gotta make use of it. Here's the thing. You know how all these people or a good amount of people try to do everything on their own. Sometimes you just can't. A better person can do it for you. You have to admit that. And it's better to pay someone because it saves you time and thinking smart about it. Like, try not to think of things as upfront money, like, oh, it's gonna cost this much. With detailing, I have all the detailing tools and, and it takes days for me to fully detail a car, vacuum, and like paint correct it. You could pay someone a couple hundred bucks and it's done. Before I leave though, Shout out to your boy Germ. My shirt came in, it's sick as hell. And I really look forward to where he's gonna go in life because he got it down. Reason why I am so, I guess, my hair's crazy, I don't know, I'm growing it out. I ran a 5K nonstop. I've been trying to do that for a couple weeks now and I finally got it. 30 minutes to do 3.1 miles. That is not fast, but I did it all nonstop. I used to have to do intervals and all that. It's a way to save money because I don't have to pay for a gym membership. Consider it. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for checking in with me. I appreciate it so much and stay tuned for the next video.